My name is Dr. Jared O'Shea, and I'd like to give you something to think about. I used to like teaching children in my classes the story of Abraham. It's quite a confronting story because, as we know, Abraham was asked by God to sacrifice his only son, Isaac. When I tell that to children in classes, it strikes them as odd. And what I like is to get at least five minutes of outrage as it dawns on them that Abraham was going to sacrifice his son. And is that good? Is that right? Is that fair? Why should he have to suffer like that just because somebody else asked him to? And then it enables me to say these words. You're right, it is an outrageous thing for a father to sacrifice his son. But in the end, Abraham didn't have to do it. But one day, there was a father who did have to sacrifice his son. And of course, that was Jesus. Abraham is a shadow of God the Father and Isaac of Jesus. Think about Isaac's journey. He had to carry the heavy wood up the hill. He was the one who was laid on the wood to be sacrificed to another. Let's just think about that.